I'll bet you're seeing lots of beautiful winter squash in the farmers markets and at the roadside stands, your grocery stores. And I love squash season. It seems like normally, I'll choose the butternut squash. They're the ones that have the little bulbous bottom and the long neck because they're easier to cut than these hard skinned winter squash that I also love, but I kind of avoid because they're kind of dangerous to cut. So rather than get out a cleaver and try to get the hard squash cut, I found a little trick that I wanted to share with you that makes it so much easier to cut it in half or any kind of pieces you want. So I preheated my oven to 400 degrees and I put my whole winter squash on my baking sheet, put it into the oven, and I set the timer for 20 minutes. That's all it takes to soften the skin. So it's hot because I just took it out of the oven, but I'm going to show you how much easier it is to get your chef's knife through this softened squash. So I'm just going to start at the top and go right through and just carefully cut through all the way to the bottom of the squash. And then at this point, you can take out the seeds with a spoon, put it back on the baking sheet and probably bake it for another 40 minutes, it'll be nice and tender and creamy. And at that point, you can decide what you wanna do with it. You can make it a little sweet with brown sugar and butter and maybe a little cinnamon. Or I like to scoop out some of the, well, all the seeds and after I get the seeds out, then nice and soft squash, ladle some soup into it. It's really a nice little serving bowl for soup. So an easy way to cut those hard winter squash. I'm Sue Doden sharing good food for Good Life 365.